Yeah, thanks for coming, everyone. Uh, just to, here to um, uh, let people know this will be the last day for our, our staff here in Parliament. The Premier uh, said this morning that she's here to protect jobs in Queensland, but there's uh, four that she's uh, got rid of, and, and we've got the face of one of those staffers here today. And uh, we also wanted to put, uh, use this opportunity to thank all those people out in the Queensland, the flood of support and the uh, financial assistance, uh, those generous gifts, donations that have come in from people uh, to help us try and keep, um, uh, keep uh, the fight up down here in Parliament against the two major parties. And, um, and just to put a face to those jobs that will be uh, lost today, we just want to invite um, Brad Tassel up, who's uh, one of our staff, has moved up here from North Queensland, sold his house and is now without a job. Uh, look, I just wanted to say um, I'm one of the four staff that has been dismissed and will finish up uh, tomorrow afternoon in Parliament House and obviously one back in the electoral office in, in Charters Towers. And I just wanted to say that you know myself, John and, and Connor work extremely hard down here representing the people of, of North Queensland and also regional Queensland as well on issues that are important to those regions. Um, myself, I'm, I'm a North, uh, North Queensland born and bred uh, man. I also grew up in Cairns, so I'm very close to what the issues are in those areas. So. It's pretty disappointing for me, and you know, um, I got to hear about it while I was on holidays out at Birdsville Races on Sunday through a tweet, I think, from Sarah Vogler uh, through through a Twitter account, and and that was extremely disappointing for me to hear that. And, and I just believe that you know we're victims in in regards to all of this, and um, I think it's uh, disgraceful to the Premier that she's you know used coercion to basically threaten another party to toe the line and threatening to take away their resources or in fact taking away their resources that only serve regional Queensland. So yeah, that's very upsetting for me. Um, myself, I'll be taking it to the Fair Work Commission as well because I believe that we've been, uh, we've been removed uh, uh, unfairly and I'll be certainly following that through as well with that complaint. Uh, well, I've spoken to the boys and I think pretty much all of us are going to go to the Fair Work Commission and, and, and see it through. Um, I, I know myself I'm really keen on doing that because I just think that you know, we've, we've worked very hard uh, for the Cattle Party, we've worked very hard for regional Queenslanders as well and I think that through no fault of our own this, is, this has come about. So, and I think the way and the manner that it's been done has been pretty disgraceful.